I got a film, I'm already uncomfortable, and now you're watching. Nope, I'm out. <laughs> as soon as you said I got a film, I started watching. <laughs> yeah, no, get her. I get her. Get is. her on film. <laughs> All right, we are back at all-wheel drive tuning with the B9S5. Last week, Ryan installed all of the components that we had hardware-wise from 034 Motorsport to go Stage 2 Plus. We're still missing the TTE Turbo, uh, as well as the Miltec exhaust, but at this particular moment, it's got everything we've got on it, from intercooler to inlet, intake, coil packs, new plugs, and downpipe performance-wise. And then once you go to suspension, we've done every arm on this, every chassis mount, everything like that 034 offers, as well as new brakes uh, front and rear for the car. We're gonna get it back on the dyno and see what it makes. I haven't looked at the Stage 2 Plus figures because we thought we were going straight from one to TTE. Uh, so I never even looked at it. So I'm guessing we'll make somewhere in the fives because butt dyno is always right. Uh, but we'll see. It was like over, it's like overloading. If you don't, if you don't load, if you don't change the, if you don't control the fuel. You gonna talk to us about it? Yes. So. While Keith's getting this on the dyno, I did want to mention the fact that we did do the high pressure fuel pump on this car, so we could run 85 on the stage two plus file. We're choosing to run 93 on this particular run because we feel that without flex, most people are probably gonna run 93 in this vehicle. Um, so that's what we're gonna run right now. When we do go to the TTE and the upgraded injectors that 034 is coming out with, we will be running E85 on that file to see what kind of power we can make at the, at the high end. Just run, uh, Keith has just done three pulls in fourth gear, uh, just due to speed, which is gonna make less power because the, the one to one on this transmission is actually sixth gear. So we're gonna do a fifth gear pull. Uh, he feels comfortable doing that. So he's gonna let it rip real quick and it should make, um, hopefully, over at 500 wheel torque. So 392 and torque stayed the same? We went up a little bit too because it's loaded a little better, so 392 on our 492 on it. So. Okay. That's right on par with what they say it makes at the wheels essentially. I think they, they did 405 or something like that horsepower wise and then right at like the 495 on on pump. I mean I'm sure on a down jet it'd be there all day. Yeah, well they have a Mustang. Uh, 
and they, you know, it is what it is. We also just did three pulls before that pull, so like. Well, the the 500 series also the calibration is a lot different because the rollers are smaller, so it usually gives you a little bit more forgiving number too. Right. <laughs> I like the heartbreaker stuff. <laughs> That's cool. It looks like there's uh, the the main thing that's on the back is back pressure, probably on the turbine, just because it's just such a small turbo for what we're asking of it. Yeah. Because that's why the, you know, the torque is just If it would just not have as much back pressure, we'd have a lot more uh, open fields to speak to run with, horsepower wise. <laughs> well, we'll see with the TTE then. Yeah, once you get the turbo in there, you'll probably see that. Yeah, same thing. Uh, it, so, is it still going through stock like resonators and everything? So, yeah, the, the exhaust is stock outside of the downpipe. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, so it's still got... Yeah, yeah it's factory got, uh, resonator, factory... Yeah, uh, yeah, okay. I'll say, because it's... Like, even just, like, even the cat back might open it up over four. For sure. Yeah. Yeah, just, yeah, just to give it that little bit extra volume that comes through, so it's not so, like, <laughs> You can see once it peeks out, it's like, ugh, a wall of torque. Yeah, just yeah. done. <laughs> Just wrapped up things at all wheel drive tuning. The car made 392 wheel, 492 torque. Um, that was in uh, fifth gear because one to one on this transmission is sixth gear. Uh, all the other pulls we were doing were fourth gear, even the stock pulls we were doing in stage one uh, last time we were here. Um, next time, in the next video you see of this car, it's gonna have the TTE uh, 810 on it, as well as the injectors from 034 that are kind of in beta right now. They're not quite out yet. Uh, and then we're going to shoot for an E85 700 ish uh, at the wheel uh, on this car. Uh, it's been a real enjoyment, and uh, we look forward to seeing you in the next one.